Digetonga, County Commissioner Migori. Uh, today, very early in the morning at 5, we, we had uh, the honor of a visit from our CA's interior, Honorable Professor Kidiki. Uh, he met the county security team, all of us, and uh, the issues we discussed were about three. One, the issue of uh, lambent illegal mining activities in the county, which are denying the government revenue, and also reading to laws of life. Over the last, I think, uh, five months, we've been able to, we've lost over seven people through collapsing of illegal mines. So we were directed to ensure that we form a motor agency team to immediately embark on crochet of four illegal artisanal and commercial mines. In Migori, a sample we have from an audit done over on Saturday, I think there's only two or three operators or miners with licenses. So that one, uh, we're in the process of forming a motor agency team to ensure that the directive is implemented and uh, we're requesting whoever in Migori is doing illegal mining to cease forthwith before we leach them. Again, we are directing that for them to be licensed, especially the artisano miners, the cabinet agreed that they should be in cooperatives and fulfill the requirements of environmental regulations and also health regulations. So for that one, and uh, I'm saying again, I'm repeating, we requesting the members of the public involved to ensure that they cease mining with immediate effect. Number two was about the ongoing clackdown on illicit blues, drugs and substance. Uh, Migori was uh, identified as one of the corridors for Bangi and Ethanol entry into the country. So, uh, so far we've been able to do well. We've netted over 1,000 kilos of cannabis sativa, seized two vehicles and a motorcycle, arrested several people involved in the trade. We've also been able to destroy over 100,000 liters of illicit bruise. 92 people have been arrested. We've been able to close several premises, arrested uh, people operating illegal chemists and uh, agrofets. So far, five and seven, and uh, we're going on with the exercise. And uh, we were directed. You remember some times back, we lost over 20 people at Dusit through terrorist attack. In Kalinyaga, over 20 people died due to illicit blues. So there's no difference between uh, illicit blues and terrorist attack. So this is a continuous exercise. We are not going to relapse and uh, we'll continue on clacking and we're requesting even the media to direct as where well. maybe we've not been able to reach and also more so the premises which are operating close to schools and health facilities. The other issue we were directing to continue clacking on is the maintenance of security. We know of late we've been having political, politically instigated violence, especially during funerals. Uh, these are political goons, they are criminals. Kenya is a democratic country, as we were told, and as you know. And uh, we should have uh, anyone with divergent political views express them. So we've agreed, we're profiling them, we're working on them, and uh, irrespective of your political affiliation, if you're involved in a political organism, we are going to deal with you. The issue of uh, border insecurity. We've been having challenges with our uh, neighboring county, that is Nalok, and uh, 
we've uh, briefed the CS on the issues that needs to be done about it. We know there is a challenge with the issue of rad ownership. And uh, livestock uh, theft is only a smoke, smoke screen covering up the, the real issue, which is the rad dispute. So he's promised to come back. We're also going to consult with our neighboring county so that we can be able to, to sort out the issue. On issues of security and also, as Idaria said about the Iri City Brew, is agreed to ensure that we have a formation of uh, posting of a formation of the border patrol unit along the common border in areas where we've been able to identify as the entry points. Uh, again, is also agreed to support with grading of the security rooms along that area, including ensuring that the, we have uh, adequate patrols along the, the, the rig. So those are the things we are, we are going to implement, we'll continue. We're seeking for the support from all the people, the media, the community, we'll work together with the county government, other government agencies to ensure that Migori uh, becomes one of the most pro productive countries, a, a, a prime investment destination, and uh, not a, a conduit for illegal and uh, illicit trade. Thank you very much and God bless you.